How's it going tonight? Hope you're all having a good night. I'm going to jump back in tonight for a little bit more of House of Ashes. Uh, we're going to try and kind of bump our way through that. Hopefully we should get to the end of the game fairly quickly. Uh, and see what it's all about. If we do get to the end of the game fairly quickly, we'll have to play something else and I'll have to work out what that is. Because uh, I'm not sure if we are going to get to the end or not tonight, you know. Um, I don't know how much more was left of the game where we kind of left off. So yeah, we'll play as much of that as we can. I've got a few different options for things we could play afterwards. I'm um, thinking po probably something short because, you know, obviously we're not going to have a lot of time left, I would imagine, afterwards. But that doesn't really matter for now. Shall we just, uh, shall we just get jumping into the game? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Do, 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 do. I was hearing uh, somebody was telling me apparently they were outside uh, that, what do you call it, uh, COP26 or whatever. Uh, apparently they put up a lot of the stuff around about where their house is and um, they couldn't get into their house and got arrested for it. You'd think they'd have sorted all this st sort of stuff out before they did that, wouldn't you? You'd think they'd have sorted all that sort of stuff out, uh, let alone worrying about uh, flying into something that's supposed to be about the environment. Are they bothered? Who knows? We'll see what comes of it. Usually not very much. Usually not very much. Anyway, I'm going to try not to be too political about things right now. Or at all, really. And jump straight into uh, jump straight into a game, I think. Let's get this music off and let's get going. So yeah, House of Ashes. That's what we're doing. We are, as I say, relatively um, far into the game, but I don't know how much more we've got left to do. So let's just get going and let's kind of see how it goes. From here, I got to regroup with Allied forces. And I think that um, there was concern here that she might be turning into one of those weird vampire creatures. We're on the wrong side of the chasm. We'll never make it. Possibly. Don't quit on me now. I mean, we saw the other guy turn into one. It's starting to turn into one anyway. We're going to swing across, are we? We have to swing over. Swing, swing, hold. swing. That rope won't hold. Listen, Clarice. Once we get over there, we can get, I don't know, some fava beans. Do you really believe those medicines will help me? We'll reassure her. We don't know. Keep it together, Clarice. We'll we don't know, there. do we? We don't know what the f Maybe what the hell's wrong with her. Because I don't know. Where I see it. Really I can't answer your question if I don't know the answer to it, can I? Bearing updated. It's looking doubtful. Would not have been a great answer, would it? There we go. Made it. No bother at all. Are you going to throw the rope or what? We'll help her. This might be. This might mean my death, but we'll help her. Okay. Can we, we can't get the rope back though, can we? What if we need to do that again? She's not going to turn now, is she? That answer your question? <laughs> yeah, I guess so. It wasn't so good. Get to the temple! Get to the temple! I don't know what's going to happen though. Yet. So okay, so I thought she was dead in the last the last time we played because she fell down that hole and we'd seen the premonition before where she got skewered on a on a big spike but I guess um, I guess she didn't she fell in a big pool of blood instead just the kind of thing you want to find when you're wandering about eh? big pool of blood some kind of sacrificial pit maybe I'm not seeing anything come up considering how many thousands of years old it was you wouldn't think there'd be a lot of blood there. <laughs> Eyes alive. 
motion track, what, cameras and keeping an eye out for these things sneaking in. Almost feels a bit like aliens or something, you know? Premonition! His neck gets snapped by something. Or maybe nothing. Right, where are we going here, anyway? Up the stairs or over there? I don't know if our gun will be much use either. It doesn't seem to have made a great deal of difference against those things. Everyone should be hang should be carrying around one of those UV things. I guess they don't have enough. Can I put that light on? No. And you remember, these doors were needing two people to open before. All good in there? So I'm not allowed to go in there. Alright, fair enough. Take a bit of a wander about then, see where we're going. It's not very fair, they get to stay in there relatively safe. If they hit us, my best hunch is it'll be from the chasm. Yeah. <coughs> you feeling optimistic, Lieutenant? I'm swarming up out of the chasm. Wouldn't surprise me. I can tell you, the Colonel could lose his own ass if it wasn't pinned on him. You see our absent friend down there? There's a lot of light bouncing off me if I put my head up like that. We'll try not to do that too often. We're facing an enemy we know zero about. An enemy of unknown size and their home turf. Sucks to be us. Yeah. I don't know how long those doors <laughs> it definitely back. does. It definitely does. Fix it up, call in the cavalry, even shit up a bit. There is a yeah. transmitter up there. If you can get anyone. I have a limited range. Damn it. Barricade a loud close air support. Those birds could have picked up the sink. I don't trust our fries to fuck you in the ass. So, it's starting to become obvious that I should have asked for that air support. But, you know, hindsight's twenty twenty. That's what they say, right? I'm gonna need a hand to get this up and running. Yeah, well. Good luck. Some ancient radio technology. That looks like it's fried. That thing looks like it was sabotaged. How would they do that? Maybe they didn't want anyone else to come down here. Make sure nobody could radio out so nobody else got in there. The radio's working now. Good job, Sergeant. We're just bringing them more food. No, don't do that. Those things will kill you, sir. But considering the situation that they're in right now, I don't think he's too concerned about that. You know, he probably, sh you know. Oh, that's a shame. Just forget about it. Don't, don't go and look for it. It's good. It's nothing. He's just realised. Because he found the lighter on the desk, his wife's desk. Something's coming through on the radio. It's just a ghost signal. Even without a transmitter, a radio picks up a faint signal. It's just ghost, man. Right, aye, but does it work for calling anyone else? If we can establish a signal and contact CENTCOM, then we're one step closer to home. Is it going to have the range needed? If Marwin was here, though, he could fix it. No shit. Yeah, well, he's dead, Embrace so suck. move on. Unless he comes back as one of those things. Maybe we can get him to fix the radio while he's trying to eat us. I mean, no worries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll give you my, I'll give you my leg. Uh, once. Once you got the radio working. Okay, now Salim didn't shoot at. Some of us, but then other guys aimed their guns at him. Surely these guys realize that we need help getting out of here. Regardless of who it is, right? Yeah. They can get you out of here. Mind you, they could use the radio to call their troops. The demons. At least monsters, right? I mean, we don't know that they're demonic yet. They're, they're just 
creatures looking to survive, aren't they? Until we hear otherwise. Should we stay here and rot then? I mean, what does he think he's going to do? There's three of them, two of them. So he's going to try and attack now. And what if he shoots the radio? That doesn't sound like a very nice signal. I'm bringing all these things down on top of us. Maybe that's why they broke the radio. <laughs> I need more time. Because it was making those noises. I need you on the cameras in case we get blank. I got this. Lieutenant, I I said I got this. Yeah. Go! Away. We'll deal with it. Come on. We could really do with that UV light thing. If he's gonna be fighting them. You know. It, oh, there we go. Here comes the here come the other guys. Why would the fuck would you break the fucking radio? You stupid idiot. Shit. Now how's he gonna get out? I'm just <laughs> Nice shot. Hopefully he gets grabbed by one of those things. What are we waiting for here? It's like Slim wasn't trying to kill anyone initially. Well, he decided not to because we didn't shoot that guy in the back near the beginning, but... Yeah. What are you doing? Don't, don't even think about it. <laughs> don't think about trying to survive. We need to flank him. The only way we're gonna get rid of this cloud. I think it's a bit late, to be honest. All this noise is going to be dragging those things up. Just shooting the area. There we go. Go, go, go! Run, 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 run! Push forward! We got to a stage where we can successfully flank him yet. Flank him! Alright, yeah, yeah. Got ya. Well, let's watch out for Salim as well. He's about. A wee slight, nice. What we're doing now? Well, we're trying not to trip over the wires or something there. What was that all about? It just takes a, like a massive a face plant of the. Uh... Oh what? No. You're gonna. You're gonna end up hurting someone else. What is wrong with you? What's what's wrong with him? He wants to survive. Same as you guys. Is he going to run away again so he won't see the monsters? Oh, there, rabbit. That'll do it. How the fuck? I aimed at his head. And he shot the bloody light out. Should have aimed a bit lower, maybe. So now they pull out and we have to deal with all the monsters. Yeah, here we go. Run! He's not going to be very happy. Could they not like set that light up in a doorway or something so they couldn't follow us through the doorway? Yeah, that ain't going to stop them. Whereabouts are they? They run away. Oh, they're alive! 
Rachel? They're alive! They're finally reunited. Reunited. Do, 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 do. You're alive? Yeah, just about. <laughs> just about. If there was any doubt about the situation with him and um so those things take you. with them then it's clearly obvious now what's going on. Where's Eric? Right. Well, right here. Oh, always yeah. oh, getting annoyed. Let's not uh, let's not worry about this right now. Let's worry about it once we get out. The rope snapped. I, I didn't cut it. I wouldn't. <laughs> you wouldn't. You tried to. I know. Uh oh. Now he's just going to be getting even more annoyed. <clears throat> we good? But you know, he just has to just has to deal with it, I suppose. I understand you're not the brightest, Nick, but even you must know what I'm talking about. <laughs> You've been fucking him, haven't you? It's a bit heavy for right now. Don't fucking attack each other. You've got to survive. Stop it! That's fucking idiots. I know. You better step off before I start swinging. Colonel or no colonel. Don't Nick. Is that he doesn't want to? I don't know. Hello, how are you doing? I how are you getting on tonight? Really all's good, yeah. All's uh, pretty good, I think. Always loyal. Having a good, uh, having a good night. I did it. And just all right in general. I think she's turning into a monster, but we won't worry too much about that just now. She's turning into one cool. Things. Why'd you bring her here? She needs our help. No worries. Hope you're having a good day. She needs help. She's one of us. Step aside, Rachel. Oh, they're gonna try and kill her. They're gonna try and kill her. I don't know how much I've got left of this game. Um, I'd heard it was pretty short, so I might have to play something else afterwards. But I'll deal with that when it comes up, if it comes up. The thing is, she's about to turn into one of those monsters. I wonder if we'd left him to do what he was going to do, maybe they'd have stopped her from changing. Well, if we get her outside in the sunlight, you know. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay, Steph, haven't seen you in a while. Hope you're, uh, hope you're getting on alright yourself. I'm enjoying a couple of weeks off work, so that's quite nice. Uh, before then, no doubt having to run right through until uh, January or something before I can get any more time off. We can't lose the generator. We're blind without it. Yeah. I quite enjoyed, uh, well that's right, you did, didn't you? You, you? Dropped in with Hot Wheels. I was trying to get that to work the other day, but there's some sort of um, issue just now with it. Some sort of issue just now with it where it constantly shuts down with like a fatal error. So I haven't had a chance to play it again um, since then, really. Which is kind of annoying because I was really hoping to kind of get a bit bit better with it, you know? Get some more of the kind of multiplayer races and stuff on the go, but hopefully that'll get fixed soon. And I'll be able to get back to it. Fuck, that's all we need. Oh shit. They're destroying all the cameras. Oh wait, remember there was that sequence where she might get blown up by the mines. I ain't out of this fight yet. No. You're not. Come on, I don't know what's go. happening. Oh, here we go. This was one of those moments. Is she going to get blown up? Or is she going to be fine? I'm sure we wired it a different way. 
Uh, I think we're all gonna die. <laughs> I think we're all gonna die! Get the, get the light. I mean, you were never gonna, you know, stop them anyway. Do you really think that's gonna work? I'll just shoot at their arms and maybe they'll go away for a second. I'm not sure about that. I'm not sure about that, what he thinks that's gonna accomplish. Things are worse than sewer rats. This feels like, do you know, this does feel like aliens or something, you know? We're getting swarmed by these monsters. No, oh, she's about to... Oh, careful. Careful. Get that gen going. Get that gen done. You worthless pile of shit! Get that gen started. <laughs> We're not having much luck. We're not having much luck getting anything started right now. Oh yes, can we fire that with no ammunition? King, now's about the time we bug out. Any objections? No, of course not. It's all good, Silent Bull. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. They're breaking through the perimeter. Have you changed your your name? Something. Wait, yes. Nice to see you. Hope you're having a good day. Yeah, this is where uh, everything's everything's coming down on top of us. I was saying it. It almost feels like um, it almost feels like aliens or something with all these monsters trying to get in, and we're kind of hold off kind of positions. But yeah, we've got to the bit where we're getting attacked, so the slow stuff's done. Um, well, go to the gate. Now this was the situation where in the premonition she accidentally set off the mines. Shite. There goes another light. There goes another light. Oh well. Well that did something. Surely if they're like vampire monster things they'll... Uh... Ah right, I see. That makes some sense. I realised I might have forgotten the password for one of my email addresses earlier. But hopefully it's... I think I changed it recently and I'll probably remember it, so... Right, so this is the situation with the mines. Uh, keep to the centre because they're on the walls. Yeah. Keep to the centre because the mines are on the sides. So as long as we keep to the centre, we sh... What the fuck? Well, so was that going to happen anyway? We didn't touch any of the mine. How the... The mines were down the side of the wall. How the hell did she set them off? She was running down the middle. It didn't look like anybody touched them. Oh, well, she's dead now. Fucking charcoal. Oh, no, Eric's dead too. Oh, well, that's a shame. I wasn't so bothered about him. Um, that'll be the first two so far. Um, I managed not to kill anybody. I did get, obviously, that bit where she fell down the hole. I was like... I didn't cut the rope and then it did it anyway, and I thought she was dead, so obviously she came up, but... There we go, she's, she's dead again. And Eric there, it looks like, died too, so... But that's it so far. Well, apart from the two guys that I don't think you can stop from dying anyway. We should keep moving. The guy that got turned into one of the monsters and... The one that got dragged off. The two... Uh, Salim's still alive and the other guy, Dar or whatever. Yeah, there he is. Hello again. Not so, two people so far. What happened up there? I'm assuming it could get a lot worse from here on out, though. It's making me nervous. Lowering your weapon might help alleviate some of the tension. Can I get a little translation? 
Tell him to drop his weapon. Like we're probably gonna get. To give well, I don't know. You sure about that? He seems to be. Yeah, he's got more of a. He's got. A, seems like he's got a bit of a deeper kind of story, you know, Make a move. Uh, than I'm any afraid. of the others, really. I mean. I feel like our uniforms are getting in the way of what could be a beautiful relationship. <laughs> yeah, it could. I say we drill these sorry looking motherfuckers. Let's not. I mean, him probably, because he's, he's a pain in the ass. We could use their help. I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, we need all the help we can get, especially now that we've lost two people. Yeah, he seems like, as I say, he seems like he's got a bit more of an interesting story to him. I don't know an awful lot about any of the other characters, you know, they do seem to have done a bit more kind of development of his kind of character, I suppose. I was noticing as well in the in the menus, you know in the opening menus it has the bit where you can look at the different anthology stories. I noticed there's an empty frame sitting to the right of the third one. So I'm assuming... Uh, yeah. No, I mean, if he's not going to help us, then yeah, just get rid of him. Right now, we need every pair of hands we can get. Is he going to help, or what's he going to do? Just stand there facing away. Oh, did it? Because I know in the last... I know in... Um... Alright, okay. That sounds interesting. I know that at the end of the last game they had a trailer, they had the trailer for the new one, didn't they? I don't know if they will have it at the end of this one, but... Is it still going to be another, I guess it's still going to be another kind of short one, you know. Right, okay, well that could be good. That could be alright. End on the setup. I suppose the whole idea is they want it to be kind of an anthology sort of thing, so I would imagine they're probably going to keep them all pretty short. Um, It's one of those horrible monsters, and we'll have lost that. Uh, we'll have lost that UV light as well. Which is annoying. These are like um, I don't know what Babylonian vampires. Oh shit! Don't let it take him away. Too late. As she turned. Is that, um, what's her name? Clarice. Has Clarice turned? So I don't know what decisions in this will mean that we all die. Like, keeping her alive maybe was one of them, I don't know. Now that I think about it, I suppose maybe the, the more sensible option in that room with the mines would have been to go down the sides. As I said, I think there's some kind of... There's, I mean, my, my thought about them is there's some kind of vampires, because obviously they can turn people into creatures that look very like them. Um, or are they the people of... Are they the people of the city? Oh no, wait a minute. So they're the people from the city. Shoot him. It's not going to help much, but... Crucifix? I don't know how a crucifix is going to work against a Babylonian vampire. That was such a stupid thing to do. I should have shot at him. Is he dead now? <laughs> Just got to do the typical old school Dracula thing, haven't you? He's going to get his neck broken now, isn't he? Look! Yeah. Gold crucifixes aren't going to cause him any problems. Maybe see if he can cross run in water. <laughs> we know they don't like sunlight though. He's not dead, but... He's having problems. This is like one of those guys from the start of the game. <laughs> I don't suppose he's been very well fed all these thousands of years down here. <laughs> yeah. 
especially it's odd though, isn't it? Because the the creatures obviously don't look human, and the, the humans that they've and I'm going to say maybe the humans eventually turn into those things, but I mean that guy's been down there for like four thousand years, so and he still hasn't changed into one of them. So I guess they're like the. Is that Dar dead? Is it? That's a shame. Looks like they're on that Dar diet. So maybe these are like the original vampires. Oh, here, hang on. You to mess with a marine. Well, yeah, I mean that's the that's the kind of question, isn't it? I suppose they somehow. Well, I don't know. They, I mean, they did have that massive pool of blood that I wondered about earlier. It was like, how can, how could, how can all this blood still be? I would assume that because some of the, some of the locals seem to know about them, maybe even this. worship them, you know. So I'm assuming they've been feeding them. Don't you fuck Somehow. I assume. All this shit, it's on you. If you people hadn't ambushed us, none of this would have happened. I don't I'm, mean I'm, you I'm any helping harm. you, though. I swear. I don't know. I, I'm, oh, people shit. have to have been feeding them, right? Honestly. Somehow. I'm glad to see a human face. Me too. Which probably means there's an exit. Uh, that one maybe. We don't have to be friends. Yeah, we can be allies we at least while we're down here. That's something I can get on board with. Good. I think if we've been a little over enthusiastic, he might not have believed us. So. Well, well, that's a quite that is it. That's a good question. That's a good question. One, I'm not, one I'm not sure I'm going to like the answer to, to be honest. <laughs> if I think for one second you're trying to cross me, best believe me. The following second, you're dead. I kill vampires. You think? I'm I mean, I would assume sorry. maybe they. Maybe they don't want to leave. That looks like our best way through. One of us holds up the gate. Maybe. <laughs> or can slip through. For whatever reason. Maybe because they're tied to something there that keeps them there? I don't know. Go! Oh shit. Well, that wasn't ideal. Now we've been separated. <laughs> Can we lift the thing again? No. Okay. Yeah, maybe something keeps them here. I don't know. I mean, this was built as a temple, wasn't it? To some kind of... To some kind of god, I suppose. Some sort of Babylonian deity. From my side. Do it quick. Those things could be anywhere. You got any idea what we're dealing with? I don't know. Are they vampires, though? I mean, it's the... Vampires. Not yeah. possible. How not? How's it not possible? My father yeah, that's what they need. Something looks like that's shit. what they need. It smells like shit. <laughs> don't have to taste it to know that it's shit. Or somebody like that, anyway. Van Helsing, they need Van Helsing. We must work together to defeat them. Yeah. Or the guys from the Lost Boys. The Frog Brothers. <laughs> yeah. 
or somebody like that anyway. Don't drop it. Could have dropped on his ankle at least, then he wouldn't have had a foot anymore. Thanks. <laughs> but then we'd have had to carry him. So yeah, so he's using this as a kind of stake, I guess. What's the first thing you're gonna do when we get out of here? I don't know. Not come back here ever again. Well, it's another premonition, is it? No, it's something else. Right, so that is... Yeah, so there's somebody staking a vampire. In the sunlight. And what's this say? Let's have a look. Unintelligible, unintelligible. Dead. I sat with her in her final moments, telling her how sorry I was. Held forsaken place for placing my vanity above our love when... The end of everything. I knew she... She made me swear to bury this place. And on the other side, we get a wee video. No worries. Something See you when you get back. As I sat with my wife, I noticed something in her hand. Who are we gonna? Who are we gonna? Lady hmm. Bradshaw's brooch. Ooh. She must have pulled it from. Sounds exciting. What's it got to do with anything else? Turning it over, I noticed that it looked like one of the creatures we'd exhumed from the cocoons. Oh no. Were these the demons Mary had spoken about? So it's got some kind of known all along long extinct died. animals, maybe? Then Mary's corpse moved. Hmm. It was not my wife. She was reanimated. It was something inhuman. It leapt at me. And only the bars of the cell spared me from its fury. Yeah. But did they realise what it was? Can I actually read the back of that? Oh, that's just what... Right, right, that's just what he said on the video. Okay. It's just what he said in the clip. You seem like you got your head screwed on. So I, I suppose ask, so. What the hell made you sign up with Saddam? Did he have a, did he have a choice? He no choice. That's what I was going to say. Did he have a choice? Who knows? Right then. Can we get this door open? Here's this taking us back to the the main chamber. What is the meaning of those markings on your hand? Which markings? It's to honor the dead. It's the reason. Oh, I see what it is. Okay. It's as good a reason as any. It's a damn good reason. I see what it is. Reason. I have no grievance. I have no, no personal issues. Maybe you need to switch on the nude. Uh, Listen, he didn't do anything personally, did he? Who built his house on the banks of a river. When the floods came, his wall washed away. When the droughts came, it's never quite as simple as that. Water dried up, and the man was thirsty. All day, the insects bit. And you've gone to the wrong place him. anyway. Yet each night, he says to his wife, "We have all the fish we can eat." Your people chose this war, Jason. Yeah. I think you need to give your mouth some rest. Maybe. Maybe. But probably not, to be honest. No politics. Oh shit. It's coming! Look out! There's a monster behind you! What are we going to do to it? Stake it through the heart! Uh, it looks like it's worked out that the bullets uh, are harmless. To be honest. Get out of here quick! At least he opened the door for us. That was nice of him. That was nice of him, wasn't it? Oh shit. Where's he stabbing it? Where's he stabbing it? Some sort of nasty examination. We've had all that elsewhere. Come on. Oof. That was a close one. That was very close. 
think he'll trust him a bit more now, now that he's uh, just staked a vampire on top of him. Would he, would he, no. Yeah, would, would he stake his life on, on his help? Sorry about that. Dad jokes, is it? Right, so we're, we're, what have we got now? We've got a chamber here with another, with like three coffins in. Sarcophagus, sarcophagi. Is this where the woman was that was caged? That we, that we heard about in that last thing? No, it doesn't look like it. Oh, but here we go. Look, we're finding probably where they did all their research. Looks to me like a medical bay. Well. This could come in handy. Oh, yeah. If we could wire it up to, like, blow a hole in the ceiling so that sunlight came through. Old explosive in your bag, be my guest. <laughs> so he's going to stick it in his bag anyway. At least he can say they found something down there. Those chemical weapons are close, right? So what we got? We got a picture here of this will be. What does that say? The specimen contains an inordinate amount of blood in its stomach. Analysis of blood sample shows high density of adrenaline. Does the organism feed on fear? Instills fear in its victim and gets adrenaline pumping, and then attacks. Well, now that's a that's an interesting question. Do they feed on adrenaline? Do you want to hear? A, do you want a cup of coffee, mate? <laughs> Temperature and pulse dangerously high, over 101 Fahrenheit, 170 beats per minute. Subject mostly unconscious, occasionally wakes and screams, sweating sickness continues, saline supply low. Detected movement under the skin of the abdomen around the location of the adrenal glands. Would that be the kind of snake-shaped... Hmm... R suggests exploratory surgery, but I fear M will not survive the operation. Temperature 101.5 Fahrenheit, subject weakening, more movement under the skin, seen parasitic organism. Time of death, 2013. That's a long time after you started doing the experiments. Is she still in here? Okay, so we've got caverns. Whatever's down there, those explorers got there first. Hold up, will you? But is that going to take us back to that, like, blood river that they were in? You think they're still alive? Who knows? But if they are... Hope is all we got left. Yeah, if they are, we'll be alright. Don't rub it out with your foot. I think Salim seems to be alright, really. Oh, that's right. So there's only going to be the one guy left. And wherever... Clarice went? I would imagine she's probably turned by now. I just... Every time I see them going down deeper, I just think, how's, how are you, how's this going to help you escape? You're just going deeper underground. Do, 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 do. That your wife? What's that song, isn't it? I uh, never knew Dar was married, now you want to talk. It's funny how you can know someone for years. Yeah, well, never really know he was your commanding officer, he probably had a lot of things he didn't want you to know. I had no idea my captain was married. Is that the asshole you were with earlier? Yeah. You didn't make it. No, no, we got eaten. For me, one of bad guys to deal with. Quite a few of them were eating him, so I'm going to assume that he didn't uh, get turned. I don't carry regrets. So there's only... Who's left? Two of us. The one other guy. And then we know that two other people got blown up, so... Who's left? Is it Saruman creating uruk down here or something? I 
What is that mechanism for? Is that, there's a tree growing down there. Oh, that looks that looks uh, it's like nothing about like somewhere we shouldn't go. To be honest, I would imagine that there's nobody alive who knows what that is. <laughs> I don't think they made it back up. Or maybe they did. That winch still looks functional. How old does that winch look? No. No? We are not going Yeah, we want to leave. We don't want to keep going down. We're not archaeologists. <laughs> Our world is up there. Your guns are below. worthless against it. Between us and the world above. Well, pretty close. Pretty close by too. Those vampires come from anywhere down there. Is it? You want to find them in their own home? What I've been doing since I said. Or is there something worse down there? Get that elevator working. Seriously, so we are going down into the into the glowing green pit. At least that generator's working. Look. <laughs> That, that's uh, yeah, that's a that's a nice looking lift. I'm sure our feet won't go right through the wood when we get on it. <laughs> oh shit! They're coming! It's here! Jeez, I wouldn't go on that. <laughs> and back we go. All right. It looks like at any minute it could just suddenly go up, woof, smash to pieces at the bottom. I mean, he was right though, wasn't he? Why would you want to go up? Why would you want to go deeper? All right, mate. Shall we see how many have fallen into shadow? Two that I know of. Two down. There we go. So three left. Rachel and Eric. Separated in life. So I definitely chose the wrong option there. If we'd chosen to stick by the walls, we might have been alright, I suppose. Let's hope we don't kill anyone else now. I mean, it's interesting to see how they how they go, but... I don't know. And here, he told me that she was dead um, in the last little thing that we were at, so... He's not being totally honest. Jason and Salim, sworn enemies who cannot seem to bury the hatchet unless that hatchet is buried. It'd be difficult for them to, wouldn't it? It'd be difficult. I don't seem like an ungracious host, but time is against us. I'll be here to greet your charges as hmm. we cross the finish line. Yeah, he wasn't being totally honest with us earlier either, so. Be hiding brand names. Get some paper labels to stick over them. Camp Slayer, but this is three weeks ago. Again? Jesus, Eric, how many times? This is me. This is my way of dealing with it, and I'm done trying to explain it to you. Yes, yes, this is my life now, and I'll live it on my terms. Wait, what, what did you just say? We did try. So early on, we were trying to say to him, look, we're not interested, we're not interested, we're not interested. It's a real fucking bad time. I'm just dropping off the files you requested. Okay. Don't drop off the files now. Why don't you drop them off then? I just put them on the table. It's not here. You don't have to look at them yet. I'll just put them on the table. It's fine. <laughs> Seems like it's okay. We're don't worry. All running away from something. I know I am. Do 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 do. do. I just a wee burp that I tried to hide. It's okay. Do 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 do. Just everyone seems to have an opinion on it. I'm dealing with it in my own way. Are you? You got your own problems. Who knows? And whoever that was, that sounded like a a gold medal asshole. <laughs> nice. 
whatever it is, I, you'll deal with it. But probably right, to be fair. Just say the word. No handle it for you. He certainly wasn't behaving very well. <laughs> Right, so he's completely on his own. In a big room full of skeletons. Oh, this is where they dumped all the sacrifices. No, he's not here. You're on your own. Now, what are these things? What are these statues of? Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, here, no, no, no. It's that guy again. At least we know not to use the crucifix against him this time. Oh, he's fucking fast as well. First of all, he's fast. Fuck. What are you? He's <laughs> scary is what he is. Oh, okay, so he's, he's coming the way we went. But he's going to have to use that lift again. And we know there was a monster down there. Jason. I'll find but, you. Yeah, because it didn't, it didn't, it didn't get us. Oh, fuck, he's coming down the lift too. You know, maybe when they went down there, they should really have hung about. Oh, no, this is the other guys. So what is this? Some kind of tree of... I don't know. I've seen some fucked up shit life or... Nothing comes close to this. Have we entered the underworld? I played that game, The Forgotten City, um, yesterday. It's quite short. Um, I managed to get up to the end of the kind of story. And it was interesting, but... There are still, I think, a few more endings that I could have possibly got. And what's this thing? What is it? Who knows? That... That? Yeah, that could be... Oh, yeah, because they said they came out of, like, cocoons, didn't they? They said that there were cocoons that they found those things in. So these archaeologists released the monsters. And then obviously suffered because of it. There's a book. Randolph Hodgson. Um, you missed... Well, not a huge amount. We found this lift that takes us under underground. Um, and so we've decided to go deeper. For some reason. Yeah. I assume that's what it is, yeah. Because it's got... Uh, all the pages have been ripped out. Because it's got all those cocoons, obviously, that the archaeologists um, decided to experiment on. But yeah, so that there's one guy behind us who's still alive, but I don't know how long he's going to take to catch us, if he will. The ancient vampire guy came back and, like, was running at a ridiculous speed. running at like unbelievable speed considering the like kind of wastage in his muscles after all these years down here he uh, runs pretty well I am wondering if this is some kind of underworld sort of area Mary Hodgson. that'll be Mary Hodgson then oh does that all right okay thanks for letting me know <laughs> I can't end up like this no you can't. We're not going to turn into vampires. Promise. I can't make that promise. I shouldn't be making promises I can't keep. Is that all the pages that came out of that book? Okay, we've got a note here. When this temple falls, my wife and I will be something. I owe her that. At least the portrait that I carry in my watch case is the mirror that I remember. Not that thing, I guess. This was all yeah, that's it. He's just running laps. His cardio is like fantastic, you know. She led us to them. I found her below, hunched over the murdered corpse of Van Hoyten. As she turned to face me, 
Yeah. She became that. My hand fell to the closest weapon I could find. An iron tent peg. I mean that would work at least. Over the metal, her in the I like that using the like the, the images of the heart to uh... screams echo. That makes sense. <laughs> As if answering the sudden release of blood. But yeah, so well, who knows? I'm, I'm assuming there. I mean, this was a temple to some, let's say, Babylonian god of some kind, I guess. But, but yeah, who knows what's going on? Give me a boost. Is he going to help me up? Good on him. We should really hang about here and wait for the other guy because he's not going to get up. But they don't know he's there yet, so. I think, was it 4,000 years or was it longer than that? I can't remember what the year was at the start. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Some sort of... Is it is it gonna is it going to turn into like a Resident Evil Village thing where there's like some kind of big fungus thing that's uh, creating the vampires? Is that what it's doing? It's stealing the... It's stealing that from Resident Evil. Oh yes, oh it definitely does. Oh wow. I had those vibes from it, you know, early on when we've got all these kind of soldiers and... He's in that word, vibes. Is that a spaceship? <laughs> Obviously not quite as many numbers of those things swarming after us, but... Are we going to get like an APC scene at the end where we're driving away from a load of them? Is this even real? Here are the aliens. They're not going to make these aliens, are they? <laughs> we are being judged. It's like the end of the last Indiana Jones film. For the mistakes we've ever I haven't brought any crystal skulls with me, so. Zane is all I have left in this world. After my wife left us, <laughs> I gave him my all. I wanted him to have everything I didn't. It's a fucking gig. It is. But my boy So yeah, okay. So yeah. He's going to London. Well yeah, I mean with the big egg with the big cocoon things and all the rest of it as well, yeah, it's uh if only he would stop Steve. Got that feeling. See someone shout game Six. over man and then we're at the end. That'd be good. Game over man. Is this is your conscience clear, Jason? I uh, there was a few bits in it. Um, they'll be back. This place. There was a few bits in it that were okay, but there. Uh, see, I always liked. Um, I always liked Temple of Doom. And that's not a very popular choice. <laughs> and the Last Crusade's not bad. And make something happen. And I do enjoy Rages of the Lost Ark, but we go inside there and we find a way. I just didn't like that one as much as the others. I don't think. Okay, well I've got your back. Hey, whatever happens out there, I've got your back. We'll stand together. Way. Well, that's it. I mean, if if it's kind of one, you need to yeah. The only thing, I mean, as I say, the thing that bothered me about 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 Kingdom of the Crystal Skull was uh, just, well, I mean, as well as the fact that you could hide in a fridge and some and survive a nuclear explosion. Potentially, I, I think with some older lead-lined fridges, you might be able to survive like Fallout, possibly for a little while, but not uh, not an actual explosion. <laughs> And yeah, the, the, the bit where it turned out it was all aliens was a bit kind of... Hmm. They're making another one just now, aren't they? Don't know what it's going to be about. I haven't looked into it too much, but... Ooh. What is this? Yeah, what is that stuff? Some kind of spores that are... I don't know. I don't know. 
Oh, this just looks like one of those things with its wings. Is that one of those things with its wings wrapped? Yeah, that'd be good. <laughs> that'd be pretty good, wouldn't it? Only you don't know what it is that it's uh, shooting out is the only problem. Yeah, this does look just like a, the remains of one of the ships from one of the Alien films. Man, this is... This is even older than the temple. Surely. Stay close. Hmm. I'm waiting for there to be like a giant creature sitting in a chair. <clears throat> so find a way to strike back. Oh, I'm gonna, um, I'll play something else afterwards for a wee while, because obviously I've not uh, been on for very long, so. I'll finish up. Oh yeah, I'll definitely finish the game this stream, yeah. I've still got two hours to go, so I would imagine I'm definitely going to finish this, the the game this stream. <laughs> what do you think of it? I don't. I, I'm guessing it's not. Uh, there's not another two hours left. God didn't make these creatures. Something did. It's possible we've got this wrong way around. What do you mean? Maybe these creatures made us. Maybe we were intruding on that. Probably. Is that thing that thing's not dead, is it? What is this? Looks like some sort of mollusk or Oh that might not have been a good idea to play with that. That might not have been a good idea to play with that. Yeah, but that's just because we don't understand their language. They obviously have some way of communicating with each other. Okay, we're going down here. Yeah, some sort of uh, living... Are you coming? Are you coming or are you just going to stand up there? I'll go myself then. Now oh, what's this? A lever, it looks like. It's starting to look like a lever of some kind. I don't know. Oh, he followed me at least. Let's pull this lever. We've got absolutely no idea what it is. You don't think it's alive, do you? Let's find out. Touch it. You touch it. Pussy. No. If it's alive, it could do you some harm, right? Let's touch it. Oh shit. It got turned to stone or something. Well, if it wasn't dead before, I think it's definitely dead now. <laughs> why, why? Did you see that? Of course it why did we need to do that? That creature is fossilized. Must be millions of years old. Hmm. And well, there we go. I can still look at that? No. Yeah, it, well. Certainly could have something on it anyway. Could turn us into some kind of, you know, monsters just from that. Stay close. And what's this? What's... Somebody who had... Oh, look, so they they've been... Half turned to stone. And yet their flesh is relatively uh, intact on the other side. Was it armor, is it? Even earlier than that, I think. Well, he's not going to wake up, is he? Really? <laughs> yeah. 
But it could be something burrowing inside his head. That's impossible. In this place, everything's possible. Holy shit. Hmm. Fucker's been alive all this time. He's sitting here with half a head. Are they draining that person gradually? He must have preserved his flesh. His brain. What should we do? Gee. So, he's keeping them alive? No, but he's obviously he's obviously given them some kind of nourishment. I wouldn't put a bullet in his head, though. Yeah. 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 I wonder if they've been regrowing his... Well, you're right. That would explain why they're still alive. Definitely. Can we just leave now? Let's just go. So yeah, that's the reason they didn't go out, because they had everything they needed down here. And they and obviously with the sun up above they wouldn't have wanted to go outside. Because of the damage it could do to them. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. I wonder, would he have even realised that uh, that basically if we had helped him out of here, you know, he wouldn't have been able to do much. He was only half a person at that stage, wasn't he? don't really like the idea of standing under this big thing, but it does look pretty solid. Do, 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 do. To be honest, I imagine that would probably be what he wanted. <laughs> oh, more of those things. I'm still a little worried about what those things might be doing. Maybe they're turning us into vampires to protect us? <laughs> I'm just talking nonsense now. This does look more alien than... than something you'd expect to find on Earth. There are a load of those all mounted round there. Are they all feeding the... Sounds like lightning down there. Um, no, I don't think that's something... I don't think that's what I've seen, no. What's this? There's a skull. That's one of their skulls. We might need that to take off. It's late. Yeah, it's uh, a. Avoiding the dentist. <laughs> no avoiding the dentist. The bone is where they be. So something's it's knocked its. From the inside out. What are you saying? Something smashed its teeth out. <laughs> Maybe. So, all right. So maybe that's what the green stuff is. So maybe they were just regular creatures down here. It's late. And then this green stuff, whatever it is, got on them. I think we hit the mother load. Lightning in, in, the, in the, a deep cave. The hell is that? I think probably, I think you're probably right. That that seems likely to me. And what's happened is whatever the weapon is that they've used, it's turned them into vampires. Is that going to come to life in a minute? Quietly. Yeah, let's try not to step on any of that if we can. I think probably not stepping on those is going to be a good idea. Just got a suspicion that we probably shouldn't. Okay, that's got one there, that's got one there, so we have to go round. Oh, don't step on that. I'm just assuming we're not supposed to stand on those. These rot these things sound like they're cracking open to me. Is 
There's definitely some cracking noises going on. That way's safe. Hmm. We're approaching. There's some. Shit! There's some big ones in here as well. There's some big things in here. That doesn't look like a safe way to go at all. That way looks a bit better. Aye. <laughs> that would be the ideal option, yeah. But I think they're I think they're fossilized. I mean, I, you know, they look like they're made of stone to me, but who knows? But these ones are a little bit different from the other ones. Because the other ones don't have wigs that they could cover themselves up with, do they? I don't think so. What's happening here? Another skeleton. Could be anybody. I don't think we can go that way, can we? Where are you going? What are you doing? You looked at that already. I can't go that way, so it must be that way. What the hell's going on? I feel like I'm stuck on something. Right, there we go. It's very tense. Some tense moments in here now. Here it comes. Shit. Here it comes. Ah, shit. So I was wrong, I mean... <laughs> Yeah, I thought maybe they were fossilized, but no, they're not. Fo they're not fossilized. They were just waiting to hatch. Is there much we can do about this? If they all start cracking open, we're in for some deep shit. They have the a cocoon situation. They're they're like they're they're a way to visit all the old people. Huh? <laughs> I don't know if you've ever seen that film. I'll cover you. Go. Yeah, I guess that's what it is. They've been waiting in there for however long to hatch. Now what's this? Oh no! There's a research like table and stuff there. Shit, Nicky, you turned up like the fucking cavalry. I thought you were dead. Yeah, crawling through that little gap. No, <laughs> just waiting for the whole, the whole rock to just come down on you. And what is that? What is that thing there? The star chamber. How do they know what this is all called? What is this place? Why? Wow. I love when I love seeing people like create kind of scenery like this and all that kind of stuff. It's like you're creating. What's supposed to feel like nothing anyone's ever seen before, you know. Up and get the fuck out. Good plan. Sergeant K, what do we got left? So we got um eight clips of five fifty six FMJ. That is, yeah, it's really nice. A couple of nine mil pistols. I mean nice in the sense that it's, you know. Huh. Oh they've got the they've got the white phosphorus. One block of composition C four. Fucking hell. Create a wee cave in somewhere. All in is not enough. <laughs> Obviously. We've also got this. Yeah, we've got ninety-year-old dynamite. Work with what we got. It, you know, it, as well as feeling like something from like aliens, it feels like something from like a sort of Cthulhu type. I don't know, like that thing in the background just feels like something from that kind of thing as well. You know. Should we blow them up? 
Burn as many of those motherfuckers. Or one of the many other for the surface. What do you things. Think, Ooh, I'm glad you agree. Still got that med kit. That'd be a good time to use it. What's he done to himself? Looks like a bitch. Has he been did he get bitten or scratched by one of those things or something? Looks like our explorer friends are here too. So I wonder this place before we move out. I wonder did the archaeologists die down here or did they get out and just hide? Oh yeah, I mean that's that's always a that's always a possibility. It's a nuke the site from orbit. <laughs> Some uh, music. Some musical notes. And on the back... Wait. No. Oh, for goodness sake. Pick it up again. So go through the whole process again. Oh, they're definitely dead, are they? So what we got. As I discover more about the musical language of these creatures, my mind spins in wonder at how they came to be here. Did they soar through the skies in the days of dinosaurs? Did their great empire span the globe while we were still swinging from the trees? They're dead now. Their forms are somewhat like our own. But everything else about them is alien to life as we know it. The console displays what appears to be a constellation of stars, Cetus as seen from Earth. Did they come here from beyond, crossing great gulfs of space to land here? Were they trying to get home? Maybe. I mean, that's been, since we came down here, that's kind of been my suspicion. Another premonition. Hopefully it's fun about how we get out of here. just blew himself up. I think he just blew himself up. Well, we can talk to him. Could have used Rachel right now. Wish oh, is it? Oh, of course, yeah, because they did that in the... Yeah. Of course. What about the explosives? Feeling good about them? Right, right. Yeah, I remember you saying, yeah, so that's, that tells me we're pretty close to the end then. Do, do, do. Right, I'm going to go and look at the bits and pieces round about here before I look at that thing. There's another bit of paper. They're coming, we must end it here with something. If there's time, my last act will be to dictate this diary into... Found in the rubble. It can serve as a warning to anyone who... something. Let's see what this does. The bones of this temple are drenched in blood. So what, well, there's like two guys locked in a basement and they have to... <laughs> ...and rouse something ancient and wicked. A blasphemy that comes in indescribable shapes and forms. For eons we lived as children in this world. Unaware of the horrors that slumber beneath our feet. Horrors heart. that slumber beneath now our feet. We have blindly thrown open the gates to madness. I fear being taken, but I must do what I must. We must seal this place. Seal this eternity. place for all time. For Mary. They didn't do a very good job. Well, maybe they did. They say they didn't do a very good job of that, did they? But it wasn't until an earthquake that we got in here, so. Come on then. It just happened. There we go. Okay. There might have been something else there. I don't think there was though. Okay. So they tried to seal the place so that nobody else would come across this problem. They obviously didn't do a great job, but you know. Alright, so here we go. Hunts victim. Implants parasite. Parasite gestates. Host dies. Parasite takes over. So it's like a parasite flex seal. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. They did. They needed that. Or, yeah, and a bit of flex tape just in case as well. That was what they needed. It's a pity they didn't realise that at the time. <laughs> All you'd have to do is show them someone chopping a bucket in half and sticking it back together with flex seal, you know? It makes for an interesting read. Never been one for books. Wait for the movie to come out. Those adverts are fuck is that? ridiculous. It's like, you, look, if you do this, and then use, and you're like, why would you do that? 
What was the one? Did they not uh, like make massive holes in the bottom of a boat or something, and then? In fact, did they replace the bottom of the boat with the, with the, the tape or something? I can't even remember. I might just look at that ad for afterwards. Mary was a pianist. She deciphered it. She thought these carvings represented the stars. Do you see? The well, they might do. The whale. <laughs> that was right. They made a whole boat out of it. Yeah. No. I'm sure I saw. Musical than that. I saw a video of somebody trying to uh, see if it actually worked as well as obviously they said it did. Um, I can't remember if it, if they succeeded with that particular one or not. I think there may be another. <laughs> I'm going to need your help. You'd think just some tape and some kind of sealing stuff wouldn't be enough to make a workable boat, wouldn't you? <laughs> Should we touch this? Oh, hello. Hello, E.T. Phone home. There we go. What have we done? What's this doing? What's happening here? And some kind of uh, ultra vampire comes out of the hole. The ultra vampire. Isn't that something? What is it? Oh, it's like an organ. Mary believed that these creatures were once peaceful. Their language was one of music. It's like a massive organ. How could they not feel emotion? Have we not just like by doing that? Have we not just pulled a load of them down on us? But also, they didn't sound like they were having, they were chatting to each other. <laughs> I bet that's what the noise was from the radio earlier. What turned them from architects into killers? Some kind of parasitic thing. Now they're creatures of hate, animals, dead things. No one left to kill. Don't know what it was. So they slept. And they waited. That one looks like it could come back to life at any they minute, to be fair. Well, they waited for whoever was going to arrive, not shit? specifically you. I don't know, but Oldman and Mary was right about one thing. There's no more good in this place. Fucking right, there isn't. Hey, come on. Let's go burn these motherfuckers. And now we're killing them with fire, are we? We're back in the cocoon vault. Is that, is that an underground island? No, what what is that? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? It's a big mound of holy shit. Thousands of them. Okay. Well, maybe. Can you imagine going over there to like thousands of cocoons? <laughs> like, can we not just find a way out instead? Oh shit. We gotta move. Quick. Oh no. Okay. Oh no. We've been hit hard tonight. We've lost lots of people, lost yeah. Brothers. It turns out we've only lost two people, but shows the colonel. But now it's time to get some payback. Payback time. We plant charges on as many of those clusters as possible and then detonate them remotely. The second those charges go off, we haul ass to the exit. Luck is on our side. We'll do more than fry a few vampires. Excuse me. Create a diversion. Diversion? Lee, you ready? <laughs> I guess we're as ready as we'll ever be, right? Get loose, kids. Okay. I guess we're as ready as we'll ever be. It's a dynamite. Oh, yeah, so. Alright, fuck it. I'll do it. You're crazy. We'll do it together. Nah, the more of us down there, the more chances we'll Well, yeah, but the quicker you'll get it done. Take the detonator. If I don't make it... Nick, hear me out. If I don't make it... Well, then again, I say the quicker they'll get it done, but then again, if one of them gets caught, the other one will have to go and hunt for the stuff, won't they? 
Every step of the so way that's maybe not such a good idea. And if there's maybe. Radio signal, then I'll pop a flare. You see it go up. You hit that detonator. Do 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 do. Let's go. Let's do it. Is it now a, a stealth mission? We've got to do a wee stealth mission. Do not get spotted by the vampires. Or you will have to start all over again. What am I looking for here? I can't make it out. That is a cocoon. That is a cocoon. Can I do anything else? I can't. Okay. Shit, there's one there. What am I supposed to be doing here? Where the fuck did he go? Oh shit. There. There's one ahead of him. There's left. Oh, okay, so yeah. The cocoons are hatching ahead of you. You gotta move fast. Right. Are we too late? Ahead of him on his left. First dynamite is down. Over. One down. Two to go, or is it? Yeah, there was three dynamite things, wasn't there? Which way? Left or right? Um, let's see. Go right. You're right. <laughs> oh shit! Watch out! That guy's there. Is that the premonition where he gets his neck broken? I quick, get it down. Whereabouts are they? I saw one of those things creeping about behind him as well. Oh shit. They're like proper, they've got like proper wings, those ones. I think you might have been spotted. That's two down. I what's going to happen now. That's a big, that is a big mountain of cocoons. I don't see how one thing of dynamite is going to help there. It's the one that would be good to get though. Do we try it? I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. It's probably a terrible idea. I don't, I don't think one thing of dynamite will be enough to destroy this though, will it? <laughs> too easy. Here, you're the one that decided to do it. Well, okay, I'm the one that decided to do it, but... Oh, no. oh shit. What is it? He's going to be dead then. There are too many. Is it that man? Oh Jesus. shit! Wait. What will warning him do now? Uh oh. There is no way out. Yeah, he's fucked. He's fucked. Hey, how's it looking up there? Bad. <laughs> you may as well answer him now. Kill him. They're all over you, man. Hundreds yeah. of them. At least you've got the boss to tell the truth. I'm sorry, Nikki. So he's gonna blow everything. They're gonna have to blow everything up with him down there. For what happened at that checkpoint? It's a war, Jason. Bad shit happens. I should have retreated. But you know, if we can do this and get that destroyed, he's managed to. He's relatively well camouflaged. I hate these bits. Remains cool under pressure. Where's that other guy? A lot of pressure. <laughs> and we're gonna have to do it again. Okay. They're interesting little things to do. There's so many of these things. Hmm. 
He's really packing that, isn't he? You did it! Now you need to get the fuck out of there. He's obviously not going to get out of there, but... At least he knows he's going to take a lot of them with him. Oh, a spear! Watch out! He's got a spear! Doesn't really matter now, though, does it? Yeah, fire it. There's nothing we, can, nothing he can do. He can't escape. It's the only thing you can do, I'm afraid. Now it doesn't work. Oh, just disappeared. Here's where it just doesn't work. Well, we made a decision, and the decision to send him there was probably the right one to stop these things coming out again. But... Still pretty nasty. And I'm sure all the other ones... All the other ones that are still up there... Are going to be alive. Don't tell me he's alive after all this. How the hell did he survive? Get him out of there! He's still alive. I hear you, buddy. What's your position? I'm two hundred meters from the door. How's he? So we're all, we're all gonna have to go down there and drag him out. Oh, maybe we won't get the option. Maybe it won't matter. Did he still have the white phosphorus or whatever? Stick it in his mouth. I don't have any... Forget about it. Just get out. What are we doing? His grip's not grip... His grip kind of came off. Surely if his grip came off me, we would just fall straight down. Oh, shit. Oh shit. Yes! Fire a stake right through him. He's starting to grow all sorts of like spikes sticking out of him and all the rest. I've got you. Yeah, no, without a doubt he would have to be standing right in the middle of those three explosions. Now we've got to run away from the remaining ones. Because surely they're not going to be. They're not going to be dying just because the other ones are. Did you? Well, I've got three left at the moment. Ain't got time to bleed. It's the name of that. Uh, so we've got a bit of a predator reference as well. Ain't got time to bleed. We have a Jesse Ventura reference there. Well, I'm one away from that. But can we get Salim out? If. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Predator 2 was good in its own sort of way, you know? Um, but the first one's definitely the. Definitely the better one, I think. Yeah, one of us. I didn't. I didn't hate um, Predators, the one. The one with Adrian Brody. I didn't. I didn't hate that one. Just was a bit different, you know. Um, but the more recent Predator, I didn't really. I didn't really like. And the Aliens versus Predator films were good for a laugh, you know, but not much else. Yeah, there were. 
There were a few scenes. Which kind of made, I mean, kind of made some sense because they were back in the kind of jungle setting. Come on, get it! What happened there? Ah yes, stake the vampire. Straight in the chest. Hopefully their heart's in roughly that location. It's all coming down. Salim has now killed five creatures using his spear, as you can see there. <laughs> oh shit, we're fucked. That's a quick that's a quick ammo change. Look out! Yes! Let me get six. Yeah. I think it's six, come on. Seriously just throw that thing at me. Over your head. I did. I knew I wouldn't I knew I wouldn't miss, it's alright. <laughs> But I didn't know I wouldn't miss because the last time I tried to shoot somebody, he shot the wrong thing. See, the only thing that's bothering me is, right, this rickety lift with those creatures flying up out of the hole in the ground. Have we actually worked out how to get out of here yet? It's a lot of uh, a lot of achievements popping up just now. Oh man, that was unfucking. We still don't know how to get out though. Those things were all over us. Me and Celine busted through them like. Well, maybe. Down at the goddamn Super Bowl. <laughs> at least he's coming round to Celine. Listen up, I'm not out of the woods yet. What I see in front of me, you're the best. Well, the best of the best of who came down here at the beginning, anyway. We haven't seen. Um, did we see what happened to what's her name yet? Uh, Clarice. Is she going to be waiting for us up here? Well, well, remember he didn't. What he he was saying this was the last time he was going to do any of this. So at the beginning, he he didn't want to come here in the first place. So I don't know. The whole place is coming down. They could probably just help him disappear, to be honest. Oh, we got some ropes. What are you doing? What's up? Just get out of here. Just get out. Forget about anything else that's there, just forget, just get out. No, well, yeah, that's, that's true as well, yeah. Especially if you think that the whole place would be crumbling underneath them. It wouldn't be crumb, surely it wouldn't be crumbling, well, I suppose it might be crumbling from the top, but you would expect the floors just to collapse if the kind of base that's holding it up's gone, you know. I think we have to try and get out through the through the mouth thing in the roof. We can get out. We just have to climb. Who do you think he is? Ezio Auditore. <laughs> it is it is a good it is good. It is good fun. But yeah, I mean some of the stuff's a bit kinda you know. Does he make it? Does he manage to grapple his way up? Well, you know, I I, I I assume... I've always imagined that, you know, finding ancient ruins and stuff like that isn't quite as exciting as these kind of things make it out to be, you know? <laughs> D 
Daylight. But that place is now open. I, would, I guess any of those things that are left over could escape now. You still with me, buddy? Would it? Right. Okay. I see, but because there was another one of us there. Right, so because there was another one of us there, she didn't attack. This is Bailman 2 1 actual to Coyote 2. Radio check over. Because we'd have got her with the spear. What's annoying is, I think I probably could have. What's annoying is, if I'd picked the right option in that hallway with the mines, I could probably have saved a lot of them. Possibly, well, I don't know. I don't know how it would have gone after that point with five of them there, to be fair. And yeah, those things could escape. We need to tell the army to absolutely destroy this place from above. I must return home to my boy. He must be worried about me. Yeah, a lot of the characters were. There weren't a lot of likable characters, to be fair, in the game. An eclipse. Yeah, that's not good. Not again. That's not good. That's how this all started. Wait, is that? Yeah, see, that's what I was expecting. That they would all get out. So, wait, there was an eclipse. And then the ground kind of opened up. And now there's another eclipse. Almost as if they're controlling the the moon. <laughs> Are these creatures controlling the moon? Ah that's it, we just have to we just have to hold them off for a minute until the sun comes back. They've been down underground for so long, they won't even know. But yeah, so... Oh, shit. Oh. Ah. I had the controller down. Oh, thank fuck. I put the controller down for a second. I very nearly got Salim killed. Yes. That's what's that? Seven now? Don't worry, I'm sure the sun will come out soon. It's one of those Yu-Gi-Oh moments, is it? <laughs> what have we got in here? Flares. He's a fucking flare. Well, they don't like the flames, so maybe they won't like flares. They still got the phosphorus, I think. It's been interesting knowing you. Mm. Maybe we're all gonna die here. <laughs> Oops. Can I get it? That's it. Burn it. Burn it with the flare. And again. I could still get people killed here, I think, if I'm not careful. <laughs> yeah, that, to be fair, this ending is a lot more, a lot more exciting. A lot more exciting. Get him. Get him. Right on him. What's he gonna do? Throw it? That looks a little bit too close to his face for my liking. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. We're in trouble. 
Oh god. And just one one quick time event failed and we'll end up with more people dead. Well yeah. I remember I um went to uh there was like a, a paintball thing for somebody's um like stag do before their wedding and um someone threw a smoke grenade to where I was to where I was hiding in cover. So with my bare hand I picked up the smoke grenade and threw it back to them and burnt my finger. <laughs> so yeah. In hindsight, throwing back the smoke grenade wasn't a good idea. There we go, they're fucked now. The power of the sun! <laughs> Don't know how many of them made it, but they might not want to come back. They might not want to come back after that. Possibly. Nice. <laughs> nice one. Just happened to get the exact right location as you turn. <laughs> I need to see my boy. But that would be quite, that would, could be quite painful. Very painful. A souvenir. Yeah, <laughs> I would imagine so. Oops. Shalane, wait. I suppose you've got to be careful as well, you know, sometimes you can get booted from the game for that kind of thing as well. Yeah, that's it, just a wee trip to the hospital, but, you know. Thank you, Probably Jeff. a little bit of a bruise left for a wee while afterwards. Goodbye, my friend. But yeah, I mean, it would still be... <laughs> it would still be pretty nasty for a wee while. Well, there we go. They're just, uh, they're just happy to see the sunlight again. Happy to see the sunlight one last time. Well, maybe. So they just let him go home. And the problem is, can he escape from the? I guess, I, mean, I guess he's going home, because they couldn't have taken him with them back to their base or whatever, I and mean, they couldn't have kept him there. Um, he probably, he probably knows his way. He probably knows the way quite well, I would imagine. Being from around the area, he might know the way quite well. But if he'd hung about, if he'd hung about with them, then he would have got arrested and got in all sorts of trouble, probably. Maybe, well, maybe he know, maybe he knows where he is. Maybe he knows where this place is. I don't know. I don't know. Or maybe he's maybe he's still walking right now. Get us the fuck out of here. This happened in two thousand and three, right? Maybe he's still walking. And Salim never made it home. But yeah, I mean, I would, have I would think he probably couldn't have hung about for these guys to arrive, you know? Yeah. <laughs> he might be. His son doesn't live in that house anymore, and... Did none of them notice all those weird bodies there? See, the, the worry would be, now you would expect, you know, in one of these things, that somebody would be like, so what are these bodies doing here? Let's take one of them, so we can find out what it is. You say there's more down there? <laughs> well, that's it, you know, because I'm, I'm sure that wasn't all of them that came out of there. Really, what they should be doing is telling their telling their commanding officers that they need to nuke the site from orbit. And there we 
we go. I'll have to work out what I'm going to play for the rest of the stream. Now. They stood who stood and fell who fell. Not bad. You guided some of your charges to the light. Or maybe I'll just finish with a couple of games of Dead by Daylight or something. Survival often comes at a great cost. Do, 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 do. I don't want to start. I don't want to start any. I don't want to start any new, any big, new games when I've only got like an hour to go. You know. It's a little more homely next time. Somewhere you'd be guaranteed a mm. decent night's sleep. And he's dropping the hints. Rest assured. Wherever it is, he's dropping the hints. You'll find it extremely hard to leave for the next one. See, they've got like three. Oh, the books would have been... Right, so the first two books were the first two games that were sitting there with the symbols on the side of them. Does that mean they're only planning four games? So what's this? We've got outtakes now, have we? You're late and you look like shit. See what I said about them, about them going to look at the, the, the vampires? Good flight? Oh, shit movie, shit meal, no leg room. You cram me in the back? It's the company! Nice. They're here to do some experimenting on vampires. Fucking muffins. Did you read the brief? On the flight. How's it going with the analysis team? The ISG They couldn't leave well enough alone. They're trying to work out if it's a weapon or not. Poor bastards. And the entities? Like nothing we've seen before. The entities? Ah, oh, that's the... That's the parasite. First Lieutenant, Marine Force Recon. That's the parasite inside them. Or so they advertise. Fuck! Now how many times do I have to keep telling you the same damn story? I understand. However, SETCOM needs to iron out any... They extract and... Such as? The whole fucking thing was a <laughs> Yeah. Well, it was just a normal... It was just a normal day, you know? Just a normal wee... Uh, just a normal wee job. We just went out and... Went underground and killed a load of vampires. I stepped back into that hell to save Selene. And that man was worth five of you people. <laughs> Semper fucking five. And Colonel King? What about Colonel fucking King? He died. How did he die? Get over it. He led us all the way to hell. Hell burned him up. I mean, it, it wasn't really his fault that they ended up all the way to hell, was it? <laughs> With an Iraqi soldier down there? Republican guard, if you can believe it. Well, we needed to, we needed to survive. Both tacticals out for him. I'm dying to meet this guy. Well, good luck, he's not here. Nothing to show. He walked. What the hell's that mean? He when went home. The extraction team got here, he was gone. Could be across the border by now. Sneaky son of a bitch. No, we let him go. Check enlisted his help. The analysis team are still pulling specimens from the site. There's carnage down there. They use dynamite? Do, 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 do. They got their hands on it. No, no. Did they know this was here? It was a city, a goddamn city full of those Did they know this was here and that's why they sent us? Thousands of them. How many organisms were still alive down there? Too many. Oh, for all sake. They all fucking burned. They're gonna try and weaponize them. This is like Winterfold all over again. Uh huh. Ah, and here we have Colonel Eric King. Because of course they are. Why, you know, because stupid fucking idiots will try and. Two were married, right? In the wisdom sense of the word. <laughs> Jesus. Blue on blue, apparently. Kicked one of his own trip wires. Was running for his life, no doubt. He set the bloody trip wires. It mistook the temple for Saddam's weapon depot. Do you think? I wouldn't say that. It's been a big find for us. We've been lucky. No, no, you haven't been lucky. You haven't been fucking lucky. You've been bloody stupid. Burn it all. <laughs> Dear God. Is this? There's barely anything left to identify. What is that? You read her profile. Yeah. She could have gone far. That's uh, Clarice, is it? This hadn't happened. It's Clarice. Janet's making hot pot. You bet your ass we're on. I'll never get used to this job. 
Why would you want to? Where's this going, I wonder? Where's this going? What do you make of it all? We decontamination shower there. Only thing that matters is controlling the flow of information. As far as the world knows, not a damn thing happened here. <laughs> Seal it off then. Forget all about it. But they won't do that. Skip to the end. I'm just wondering if it shows. Does the trailer show up at the end of this? Or? Yeah, it does. There we go. Let's see the trailer for the next game. Think of the most profound thing you've ever done. The most beautiful hmm. thing you've ever created. It has got a bit of a saw feel to it, hasn't it? And I promise you, it's nothing compared to watching the life bleed out of someone. Lovely. To see the fear in their eyes. To feel them pawing at you for release. Right, so... I was trying to see if he looked like anyone obvious. That's true art. That's what you have to be. An artist. Nice. Um I've left my mark on the world. <laughs> well that's messed up. Have you? Looks interesting. We'll definitely be playing that. The season one finale. So there will be a second season of dark pictures of some kind after the devil and me well we'll definitely play that when it turns up whenever that might be but now i'm gonna to have to go and think of what else to to play but i'm gonna take a couple of quick no we're gonna play dead by daylight actually we'll have a couple of games of dead by daylight to end the stream um but i'll have to take a quick break first